And to be honest with y'all, I really almost changed my mind because it's a lot of people out here. But it's certain stores that they're going into. So I'm going to just go to Big Lots and Ross right here. I don't think I'm going to go in anywhere else over here because it looks super packed. Okay. Um, I'm going in Big Lots because I like their little stuff um, for like kids' rooms. They be having some cute stuff. I don't know if you guys, if you're new, you didn't see it. But for my other cousin's birthday, I got her this um, unicorn pillow. But um, this cousin, she's doing her daughter's room, like pink and girly. So she was like, I can get something like that or just clothes or whatever. So I'm going to go in Big Lots and see if they have something. And if they don't, then I guess I'll just get her some outfits or something. Um, there's also a sex fit over here and a lot of people aren't going in there. So I'm basically going to go in the stores where it ain't a lot of people at. Okay? Because I'm not trying to... I'm not, I'm just really not trying to go in all these stores. Um, but, um, my little cousin, it's it's gonna be real hard to upstage her daddy. I want to tell y'all, like, he bought her a goat for her birthday. I'm gonna upstage a goat. My cousin was like, girl, they text me, um, call me. I mean, I'm talking about text, they little. She turned five. Um, but she was like, yeah, girl, they call me talking about, can we bring our goat home? And she said, I was like, yo, what? <laughs> they freaking dad got them a freaking goat, y'all. And I'm just like, boy, a goat, but... He got like a whole little, I don't want to say farm, but I guess that's what it is. He got like some um, horses and stuff like that. They already have horses and stuff like that with their dad. Um, so he got some a baby goat child. And I'm just like, child, anything I get, she gonna be like, hmm, baby, she didn't got a goat, honey, okay? But I'm gonna go ahead and go in Big Lots first, y'all. So I'm gonna take y'all in there with me too. Get my mask on. Safety first. And I said, I'm gonna buy like, I'm gonna end up buying the little regular blue ones like at the hospital and put them on first and then my mask because it's getting real out here. Ooh, it ain't even time to stay on. I don't want the outside to touch my mouth. And then me with all these braids. There you go. Here we go. Yeah, I look cute today if I must say so myself. I look real cute. I got on my blue jean dress and one of my little fashion over dresses. You know, in my little pink sandals, honey, you know, somewhere else white. She broke your heart, and ever since that day, boy, you ain't been the same, no. I played my part, did everything. Oh, 
y'all, they already got Christmas stuff out and if I don't know if I told y'all, but I wanna do a white Christmas. So I'm gonna have to come back in big lots, but that's not what I came for today. So I'm not gonna buy anything. I actually need to stop spending so much money, y'all. But I like this uh, um, white and like blue type of color. That's cute. All right, y'all, so this is the section that I was talking about right here where they be having like little cute girly stuff. What's this? Oh, that's some wall decor. <laughs> a little picture, but that's broke off, y'all. That's some little baskets and stuff. But this is where I had got the other bucket for my other cousin's birthday. They don't have that bucket no more or that unicorn pillow. I don't see nothing that I probably really want. That's cute. I be I like to get people like a combination of things, so I be liking to get like little knickknacks, y'all. Like look at the little colors and stuff. Like, I think I be thinking this type of stuff is cute. Okay, here they do still have the bucket. They do still have the bucket. I don't have this stuff organized in there. Oh, this is cute. Oh, that's cute. It's a nightlight. I wonder how it lights up. Oh, that's so cute. That's an option, y'all. Should I make her another basket? Oh, oh y'all look. Cause I was hoping that my other little cousin, I was not hoping that she had a room, but I was wishing, cause she doesn't have her, she still sleeps with my cousin, the other one, cause you know she's smaller. So I was mad because I wanted to get her stuff like this, but she don't have her own room yet. Let's see, my little cousin's turning five, so I don't know if she didn't like all this. This is cute. My cousin didn't say she's doing unicorn, but she was just like, I asked her what stuff y'all want. She was like, oh, just pink and girly. I'm like, that's cute. Thank you, y'all got unicorns on it. I don't know, y'all. Let me look around and I'm gonna come back to y'all. All right, y'all. So in here, I'm just gonna get this night light, this wall light. I think it's super cute. And I'm just gonna try to find her some outfits, y'all. But I'm gonna get this. So I'm finally back in the car. <laughs> yeah, I went at Big Lots and was in and out, but when I went in Ross, I was in there for a whole minute. It's 3.53. I feel like I've been in like Ross by itself for about an hour. Um, I did find her some little cute little shirts and stuff and these cute little pants. Let me see. I'm gonna try to, I'm gonna show y'all since I'm in the car. But um, I had also got me some sweaters for work because I really been needing some and I was gonna get some from Target, but they were like, um like thirty dollars and i was like i always am able to find me some cute sweaters like at raw so i ended up getting me some you know just because it gets really cold in there and i had this one black sweater y'all that i would rock i really don't buy work clothes like that anymore i really don't be caring enough to be looking like a supermodel at work so i went ahead and did that but i did get these bags for her stuff ain't these cute y'all guess how i think i showed y'all on a little thing i did like a little montage i don't know if i'm gonna put that in but look all three of these bags a big one a medium one and a small one 2.99 2.99 can y'all see that these were 2.99 y'all and they're freaking cute okay i don't know why i ever go to like target and stuff in my bags because these are just as cute as target bags and they're cheap as crap like target bags i get one of these probably big ones for like 3.99 4.99 or even up to like 6.99 so this here was a freaking steal y'all let me see what else i can show y'all like i said i think i showed y'all they do not know how to put stuff in bags look at this and they must be going broke because they got this thank you bag but anyway they got her stuff her stuff gonna be wrinkled 
Dang, girl. So I got her this. It's like a two shirt combo. Super duper cute. Super duper cute. And this was $7.99, y'all. Seven freaking 99 and look how cute those are. There's some good material. This one has unicorns on it and this one has hearts. And it's like, this one is tied at the bottom. That one's just a regular shirt, but these are freaking cute. And then I saw another one, this one, and this one even comes with like some little bracelets or something. I don't know if some little bracelets, little hair ties or what, but. And this one is $7.99 too. Like I said, this one in the front is tied. That one is not. And this one has little hearts all over it and the other one has unicorns and i think let me see i don't know why i thought this shirt ruffled up oh the size of it has ruffles with the little thing this is super cute like these are some cute sets i don't know i don't want to say i don't know how people don't be affording like new clothes for their kids but honey make sure y'all go to ross if y'all can't find y'all kids no super cute clothes like go to ross and like marshall's and stuff like that like they be having name brands and everything for like the low and I got her some little pants. Where they at? Here they go. And I got her these Nike like little workout pants. I love when kids wear like Nike like workout clothes and stuff. Like they grown, like they going to the gym, y'all. But they're super duper cute. Look y'all. Ain't they cute? And these were $6.99. $6.99, y'all. These are so cute. Maybe this ain't cheap to somebody else, but it's cheap to me because I be paying full price for food and then i got this paper i said i wasn't gonna get no gift paper because i have a lot at home but i just wanted some cute little pink paper and i i said the bag's cheap so i know the paper's gonna be cheap so this was 2 dollars too and look at this y'all look at the it's like a marble type of thing and then white and pink this is super cute that print it's like some marble off the countertop or something but it's super duper cute i got her that too you know to put in her bag and then i got myself some sweaters i got a red sweater maybe i'll show y'all when i get home it ain't about me it's about her so i got me a red sweater this sweater is like black tan white and then i also got a gray one back there i ain't gonna show y'all all that because like i said it ain't about me it's about her stuff honey but y'all i'm trying to make up my mind if i want to go back home and eat or just head out to my cousin and I kind of want to put this stuff in the house, but I could just put it in the trunk. Cause I don't like leaving stuff in the car like that. I might just take this stuff to the house. And I want to put something on my stomach because I want to stop and get me a daiquiri, but I want to make sure I have something on my stomach. Um, Tisha and I had went to Shutter's last night, so I have leftovers. So I could eat that instead of buying me something to eat, you know, waste the money. Um, I said that I need to stop wasting so much money, y'all. But let me tell y'all what happened to me. So while one of my braids came out in the store, yes, y'all know I just got these. But um, I was trying on sweaters. I had got like 20 sweaters and I was trying them on to see which one I wanted. And child, when I tell you, I just, this man kept looking at me. I don't know if he saw it and I don't know if he was just standing there or he saw my braid fall. So he didn't look down at the ground. He was looking at me and when I looked at him and I looked away and then like five seconds later, I looked down and I saw one of my braids. I was so embarrassed, but not really. I was like, oh my goodness. I said that I saw, oh my goodness, one of my braids fell out. Nobody wasn't paying attention, but I see it like that and I picked it up, put it in my purse. And I don't know where it came from. I couldn't see where it came from, y'all. Look at this right here getting on my nerves. Y'all see that? I know y'all see that, that hair sticking out. This is the life of soft hair. Life of soft hair, okay? My water is warm, but I'm thirsty. Mm. But all right, y'all, I'll catch up with y'all in a little bit and let y'all know what I got going, okay? All right, y'all, what's up? So I'm at Cowboys Beer Barn. This is where I come get my daiquiri. Shout out to my subby, Clarissa, cause she's the one who told me about this spot. Okay, so I'm coming here to get me a daiquiri. I get the Baca Red Bull, which she recommended. I probably will never probably try nothing else cause I love it so much. But I'm about to get me a 32 ounce, honey. I'm about to get a little tip. And I decided not to go back home. So I'm just gonna put the stuff I bought in the um, trunk. And I'm trying to see what I'm gonna get to eat because I was gonna go to this place called Pew City. It's right here and get some tacos, but they only take cash. And I don't like going up to the outside ATM. So I'm gonna just go ahead and try their food here. 
they have tacos too, but I don't know if I want tacos, if I want a torta, if I want a burger, wings. I'm thinking about it. I think, I don't know. But I really want some tacos. Now, if you're a city, they're like one something, and here they're like 225, so I don't know. It says I can get a plate with rice and beans for 7.59, but they come with a drink and I'm getting a, I'm getting a daiquiri, so I don't need all that. Um, I might just, I need to ask her if they're the same size. Now, if they're bigger than the ones at Fuel City, then I guess I only need a couple. I normally get like six or seven when I go to Fuel City because they're small. Um, yes, I get six or seven. I don't know, y'all. I'm gonna have to make my mind up, but I'm gonna get me a daiquiri, get me something to eat, and head over to my cousin's house, honey, and just chill with them for a little bit. They said they just chilling, so I'm gonna go sit over there with them and see what else becomes of the day. But this is probably just gonna be like a chill day. You know, I went shopping, eat, drink, chill, talk. You know, maybe we'll play some Uno over there or something. I don't know. <laughs> but y'all will be with me so y'all will know whatever I do. Man, y'all reading is fundamental because I I should have been reading the menu. I'm so caught up on, you know, what I normally get and then not even really looking. And then it was a flip part with food on it on the back. Like, I would have got me some fish because they didn't even have chicken tacos. They only have fajita, steak, chorizo, and asada. They don't have any other meat. Like, they don't have chicken. They don't even have barbacoa. So, like, I was sitting here like, what do I want to get? And I could have just got me a fish basket. I would have went for some fish. I wanted tacos, but I could have went for some fish. And they got a fried um, shrimp basket. And they got a peel and eat shrimp. Like a shrimp boil. So, I would have tried one of those. And then, y'all, I look over here under Signature Frozen Daiquiris. And they got a freaking mud slide. A lot of restaurants don't even do mud slides except for Applebee's and I hardly go there anymore. I would have definitely tried that, but she walked by with some little fancy drinks with stuff on top, and I'm like, what's that? So I get to looking, and I see like they got like a Nutella thing, white Russian, Oreo mudslide, a regular mudslide, chocolate dipped strawberries, banana split. Like, I'm gonna have to come back soon. I might have to do me another um, breathe day tomorrow, honey, cause Reading is fundamental, y'all. Reading is fundamental. Make sure y'all read these menus when y'all go in places because you'll be missing out and try new stuff. Don't be like Brie, okay? Don't be this girl. This girl sad because I want, now I want a mud slide. And I, I could just ring my card again, but I've already paid for the other one. You know what I'm saying? So I'm just I'm gonna just eat and drink what I got, but I might have to come back one day soon this week, next week, and get me that stuff that I want to try, y'all, for a friend. Oh, y'all, I was gonna talk about, I was gonna say, I had saw on IG where, oh, I don't think this, I had talk, talked in the video, but I don't think this had happened yet, or I didn't see it until later, but Liv got a strike on her channel, <laughs> um, because Ming recorded her video, I guess, because she used her photo and stuff like that, I guess, I'm, I'm assuming, um, because it didn't say a reason, but I'm, I'm sure that's why. Um, Ming didn't use Olivia's picture, she put Marge blown up or something like that, so, Ming was a little smart. Ming was a little smart with hers, and Liv wasn't so smart using that girl picture and that girl reported the shit. But I, if I'm not mistaken, a while ago, Liv had reported one of Ming's lies, and that's why Ming can't go live or something on one channel. If I'm not mistaken, didn't she report a live with Ming's or something like that? So I mean, she reported some on her, and Ming reported some on her. It's just like, Lord. Yeah, I was cracking up. I was cracking up because she was like, somebody's bothered. <laughs> And people's like, oh, she's so mad, blah, blah, blah. If anything, I'm like, it's funny because she's just smart as heck. It's funny. It's funny. She was like, oh, fix her ass. She used my picture. I ain't used her picture. Let me go ahead and report this shit. Yeah, I know YouTube don't be playing that. They really don't. But that's a serious thing to have a strike on your channel because you can use people music and stuff like that and they'll just pay the person and they'll be like, okay, this isn't a strike. But when you get a strike, like that's serious because I think we get three strikes and then they um like they delete the channel and you won't get no type of like warning. They'll just delete your channel, honey. So I was like, damn, like was it that serious? And so when that happened, I was like, because y'all know after like the diss tracks, I was like, damn, is this like a skit? But after that and her channel being striked, I don't think this is a skit at all, y'all. I don't think this is fake at all. I don't know, y'all let me know what y'all think, but I think it's far from a freaking prank or a skit or whatever because. Thank you. Thank you. 
But yeah, I don't think it's a skit, y'all. I don't think it's a prank. I don't think so. Not because it's serious. A, a channel strike is serious because that's one step closer to your channel being demonetized or taken down or whatever. Like, that's no joke. That's really no joke. Um, this thing that came down. But all right, y'all. So I'm about to try to open my drink and head to my cousin's, and I'll check in with y'all when I get there. All right, y'all. So I made it to my cousin's house, but I'm eating my tacos real quick. I only got three. Who, y'all? This girl told me this green sauce was spicy, but everybody say that, and it's normally not that hot. This here is hot. It's I don't know what. Okay. This how they look, y'all. That's how they look. I got my drink. It's my best friend. Cause baby, when she said it was hot, she meant that. But the other place like that I go to, y'all, the sauce don't be spicy. They be like, oh, it's hot, and it don't be. This here, something else. And I don't eat a lot of beef, but this this beef is good. It's good. I don't like to eat in people's face if they not eating, so I don't have to go ahead and eat my food. You know. It's good, y'all. You talk about this mom. I prefer chicken. I don't like nothing too tough, but they good. I just need some on my stomach for that decor. I could have just got two or maybe even one. Now I've been fine because I'm not really hungry, hungry. I've been drinking my green tea and stuff in the morning and, and I've also been drinking my mixture of ACV and water so that throws my appetite a little bit y'all but y'all it's only 5 34 so I only been out since around 1 55 it was almost 2 o'clock so Two, three, four, so two and a half hour. I don't know if I'm gonna vlog when I go in here. I'll see how I feel. I know I ain't gonna do much, so it might not be nothing that y'all wanna see. So just in case I don't, I'm gonna go ahead and close out the vlog right here, just in case I don't vlog when I get inside. So I love you guys so so much. I hope y'all enjoyed this little. You know, it wasn't super long, I don't think. I don't think the footage is going to be that long, but just a day with me, a day with Bree, just shopping and doing random stuff. I ain't really did much, but I just wanted to chop it up with y'all, give y'all a little footage of my Saturday. I don't be doing much, so I don't be wanting to bore y'all. Like, I only be wanting to film when I do stuff, but this was just a little day in the life, y'all. And I'm chill with my family and probably won't film, so I'm going to end it here. I love y'all to pieces, okay? Um... Make sure y'all like the video. Make sure you subscribe. Make sure you hit the bell so you never miss an upload from your girl, okay? And I will see y'all in my next freaking video. Peace out.